All right, a little bit of a challenge. I've got these three 5G phones, the uh, Samsung Galaxy S10 5G, the LG V50, and the Oppo Reno 5G, but where the hell's 5G? So I'm gonna go for a drive, and we're gonna see if we can find some 5G. Look, this hasn't started well. I've come to a rooftop in the CBD of Sydney where I'm pretty confident there's a, a 5G signal. Uh, and on the Samsung, I just couldn't get connection. But on the Oppo Reno, uh, I got a 5G. It showed up, it says 5G on the top, but nothing would work. Switch back to 4G on the same phone, working fine. So I actually think right now, there's a 5G outage. Well, the plot thickens because now on the LG, I can get 5G network. I can get web results, but I, I can't even download an app. So something, something going on. Okay, I've had a bit of luck. I'm uh, not quite in the CBD anymore. Uh, and I'm in Ultimo and I found a street. Uh, I can get a Telstra speed test on their website. Still struggling with a few apps and things, but it's, uh, it's not awful. 300s. A lot of people walking by think I'm a complete idiot here, uh, just parking up and doing the <laughs> playing with mobile phones. But anyway, one of the things about 5G is line of sight. The closer your phone is to actually seeing the tower, the better the speed. And so what I'm doing is trying to sniff out the tower here and I've just got to 374.5 meg and a 17 ping, 17 millisecond ping. So I'm closer than I was a second ago. So look, great speeds, very good. Well, look, now this is getting uh, very dodgy. I reckon I've located it. I'm standing in alleyways in Ultima. Uh, behind me is a building, and I can see mobile towers up on the roof. I reckon that's them. And the speeds I'm getting now are very impressive. <clears throat> All right, so I'm consistently getting those speeds on the LG V50. So what I'm going to do now is uh, park up in the car and uh, switch into the other phones and see whether they get the same speeds. Oh boy, it just got interesting. Because uh, I had speed test installed on the Oppo Reno 5G, I can use the actual speed test app on the Telstra server still. 480. Wow.
This is just getting ridiculous now. 663. That was very fast. So I've now got the speed test app on all three phones because I need to be consistent now and try the Galaxy S10 5G. This is fascinating because having achieved a 700 meg speed result on the Oppo Reno, I'm now getting 300, 350 on the Samsung. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the SIM card into the LG, run some more tests on that, and then I'll go back to the Oppo and see whether we can recreate those 600 plus meg speeds. These are the results for the LG V50. All right, so this is the Reno 5G. This is the one that peaked at 700. Very consistent fours, fives, and the odd six, plus the seven. Uh, and really nothing consistently in the three. So I'm going to go back now to the Samsung. I'm going to go back now to the Samsung and uh, see what it does. Look, I won't lie, I'm pretty gobsmacked by the Samsung results. Um, I just can't get it out of the 300s. Not going lower than 300, which is excellent, but it, it won't go past 300. Um, whereas the LG V50 has 
been up and down in into the fours. I think it even got a five. Uh, and the Oppo has been consistently high. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put. I'm going to go back to the LG just to give it a few more goes because I've done a couple of pages worth of results on both. And then I'm going to call it. Um, I'm going to drive back via that first spot I went to just in case I've now got all the settings right. But uh, I fear that side is actually down. And then um, I think we've got our results. Like right now, it's looking like I'd be leaning towards an Oppo Reno 5G if you want the fastest 5G available. Well, that's pretty epic. Um, a very interesting experiment, really, tonight. Um, there's no doubt in my mind that there's something about the Oppo Reno that gives it a better speed. I think the LG V50 has similar capabilities. I just didn't quite see it hit that. Uh, and I'm disappointed in the Samsung. I'm going to publish all as much of the results as I can, including some photos I've taken tonight down here uh, at Sydney Harbour. Um, but that Oppo it looks like good value, and 5G maybe isn't quite as patchy, and I think the rollout might be quicker and better than I thought, because when I have found a tower, and I've found three or four today, um, one near the Prime Minister at Kirribilli House, um, it's not a bad range, uh, but the speed drops off pretty quickly once you get a little bit away from it. So it's coming, it's cool. Um, I'll have a full review, but EFTM.com.